Well, this old uh, Lenovo laptop here, which has been used by the bottom of the barrel for a variety of uh, functions. It's a uh, Lenovo G50. It had been used for a lot of uh, shit for the bottom of the barrel, including, say, editing videos and shit. But I mentioned in a previous uh, update video that uh, I was toying with the idea, I was thinking about the idea of, say, converting this to, uh, for other types of, uh, purposes and shit. Like, run something other than Windows. Like, converting it. And guess what? Actually, that actually had happened. But it took, say, going through a few different operating systems until I found an operating system that, uh, works. Works on a system that, uh, recognizes the, uh, that uh, allows it to have uh, Wi-Fi internet capabilities and shit built in. <laughs> like as I was mentioning, I tried a few different, uh, like when I tried to convert this to run something under Windows, like say, converting it to run Linux. It was a little bit of a bigger pain in the balls than say, when I uh, took that, when I converted that Dell on one, you've probably seen in other videos, when I converted that uh, free Dell on one to run Linux, that was, that became, Say, once it was completely installed, and was actually able to get work, and was working, and got to run and all that, once, uh, once I was able to run all that shit, that became smooth sound, but this, a little bit bigger pain in the balls anyway, tried some different Linux distributions, like say, try Linux Mint, but I didn't, but I did not recognize the uh, Wi-Fi capabilities. So, the only way it was able to get online was uh, through an Ethernet cable. And then trying our older distribution of uh, Ubuntu, but that didn't work. Sure, it, got, it ran, but same fucking results. Required uh, an Ethernet cable just to fucking get working. Then I found uh, one Linux distribution that uh, works. Manjaro. And that, uh... I managed to get that to, uh, and with Manjar, it managed, it, it actually, uh, I was able to get it running. With the, with the Wi-Fi capabilities, uh, being right, and with the, wi and with the Wi-Fi capabilities, uh, recognized and shit. So maybe I'll, uh, well, I guess we'll move on to the next phase of this, uh, the next part of it. Like right now. Now you see it's starting up. There's the login screen. And the date is correct. Yeah, the time and the date is pretty much correct anyway. Options here. I guess all I'll just do is uh, next phase of it, next figure and uh, stop the video now. Stop to say stop filming and uh, enter the uh, password and then then we'll uh, go from after that. Say go from there. I'm not gonna show you the password because there ain't any, any hints for security reasons. And we'll we'll get on to the next phase of the video right now. I can say it's loading up for sure. You can tell it uh, the man jar in your face. Bears some resemblance to uh say take some characteristics from say Windows seven and uh eight and all that shit. Yeah, it's also probably has similarities to say when there's eleven. And yeah.
And Jared does recognize the, uh, does a lot, does, uh, it's a fate of Wi-Fi drive, say the Wi-Fi capability, say the wireless networking capabilities on this one. Laptop actually works in that Manchero. So that's good. Maybe we should try to look for uh, more. Try to do try to look for something else here. So maybe we'll uh, stop the video now and then move on to the next phase of the video for sure. Yeah, I figure, hmm, make it a little bit of a tour anyway. How much of a tour anyway you can do. And some applications have been installed on this since, uh, I got this, uh, since, since, uh, Man Joe's been installed here. Off your web browser, install some shit here. Down a web browser, Opera. Uh, for multimedia. And break on away. Okay, then live is available for Manjaro. If you'll see me a player standard. Also, code, whatever, me, sir. It comes with this, uh, when it says only office desktop editors. Not much of an office program there. But you can still LibreOffice on here too. Oh yeah, printing management said here. All I need to do is fucking, uh... You can easily tell that some modifications were done there. Can't yeah, figure out when I saw we brought up as to their applications. We're processing the spreadsheet version. I just pinned it to that task bar and shit. So the whole hard drive is now used for uh, operating systems and shit. So a good part of the whole operating system is uh, a good part of the hard drive is used forever and say the root folder or all that bullshit. I guess now you could definitely say for sure. There's not much we could do anyway, but we'll probably put this to the test as well. Right now, for sure, you could definitely say for sure that that's truly it for this video. And you could also say that's it for now. You'll probably love the next video that does come along for sure. Because if you don't, you'll fucking regret it, and I will guarantee you that.